Hi everyone. In this video, we will learn the basics of conditional execution in Ansible. We have all these references in the GitHub GitHub repository. Please see the de description of this video for the link. And also, if you miss any videos in the series, please see the YouTube playlist in the video description. So what is uh, conditional execution in Ansible? Uh, there will be chances like you want to execute a task based on some scenario. Let's say if you want to execute uh, the task, if you want to install the package only if there is enough memory or if the version is the OS version is a RHEL or something Ubuntu or maybe um, you want to uh, assign some package name or the variable name based on some condition. So this uh, conditions uh, can be used inside your Ansible playbook to control the execution or control the flow of your, your Ansible playbook. Okay, for this demo, we will use the same playbook which we have used in one of the previous session. So we have this site.yaml here where we are creating this user. I will remove this, don't need this. Uh, creating the user then we will install package and we will restore the services okay it's fine very simple one let's say i want to install this uh, package only if the condition is there let's say i put some variable here um, i will say like um, install underscore package so this is a condition i put like false so here inside the task, I'm just adding a statement like when. So this pack, this task should be task should be executed only if the condition is true or false. So I will say install underscore package means it's it's true by default. It's a true or false because of the boolean expression. So I will I will say install underscore package. So what? will happen so we like ansible let's go playbook site.yml okay we can disable that okay now this is a part you can see this is skipping because if you check the install underscore package is false now so the condition fails and it will not execute now we will try something interesting one let's say i will say when not install not means it's opposite because install underscore package is false and execute actually the value is false but i check okay install underscore false then it should execute see it's executing now we have one more option here here i say install underscore package but here i put true it's fine so it will install based on the variable value then here i put when to install so when install underscore package is true it will install let's say i have some non boolean value let's say this is something like i'm going to use okay so this is not a boolean anymore so if i cannot do like this so i want to use like install underscore package equal to okay see this is working so you can do the comparison for string boolean yeah, all those things. So if I do anything like install underscore package equal to not okay. So the string is different now. See, it's skipping because the string is not working because the condition already failed. I want to install this package only if the condition uh, is like um, uh, Red Hat or CentOS. So I am adding another variable. So I will say uh, supported supported OS. So I put like um, maybe Red Hat. Then I have one more like Fedora, Sendos, some like 
for our case i just put red hat and sandos sorry fedora and here i have already one condition and i put okay it should be install underscore package so we are adding multiple conditions here so if you want to add in multiple condition you can use the and option or you can use something like this so it's an and operation so both conditions should be matched and the second condition is uh, we are going to check our ansible fact if you missed the ansible fact video please check the youtube playlist you will find the ansible fact video so we are going to use ansible fact which is ansible underscore distribution distribution should be red hat or fedora fedora so we have two options here so what i can do is if this ansible underscore distribution this value will be red hat or fedora or ubuntu or something like that so i put like in in this supported os so i put like oh, sorry ansible underscore distribution in supported os means this ansible underscore distribution value should be inside the support os either red hat or fedora in our case so if it's not red hat and if it's not fedora this condition fail so it should not proceed so we'll try something like this now and execute so there are two conditions now you will see it's skipping because I think it's a CentOS. Okay, uh, etc. Sorry, <laughs> we are using CentOS, so I have to do something like. See, it's already failed, so it's not proceeding because it's not Red Hat or CentOS, uh, Red Hat or Fedora. So I am adding CentOS in the list and we will try again now it's executing because the ansible underscore distribution fact is inside the supported os and the condition success good so this is another example uh, let's say you want to install this package only if the memory is enough something like that so in that case uh, you have options uh, called uh, you can compare with uh, memory so you can add one more uh, options let's say I have a option called uh, minimum memory so if I have some variable uh, I have to ensure okay this variable is defined or something like that so I can put like a minimum memory equal to uh, 256 MB I can put like minimum memory equal to uh, should be uh, 256 MB or greater than 256 or greater than 1 GB like that. In our case, we are going to look okay, it should be minimum memory is defined means this variable should be defined somewhere inside the playbook or project. Otherwise, this condition fail. So in our case, this minimum minimum memory or min underscore memory is not defined. We can check. Okay, it's skipping because that is not defined anywhere. Let's say if I put uh, this variable here, I put something like just for the testing, I put min underscore memory 100. Okay, the value doesn't matter. We are going to check again because we just asked, okay, just check whether it's a defined or not yes it's defined so this task will be executed this is the conditional execution so you can add multiple tasks like uh, either the value like uh, true or false or the condition like using the string or using whether the variable is defined or not or you can uh, something like um, whether some value is exist in the list of variables or dictionary yeah all those possible and you can um, use it like a combined option with the multiple uh, conditions so you can this is the hand condition if you want to use something like uh, or either a or b you can put like uh, install pack package and equal to ok or then you put the next condition that's uh, or operations 
um, this is it and uh, if you have any questions uh, ask in the comment box i will try my best to reply on that one uh, please subscribe to this youtube channel and see the description of the video for the full uh, youtube playlist for the ansible series and see you next time with another video thank you for watching